Okay? Why he sent him to the cross? And what him going to the cross did for me. And what it did for you. Amen? Okay. See, Paul is here identifying with, with the believers, especially the believers that live today. Paul said, I heard of your faith in Jesus. And Paul is praying, and I pray, that God gives us the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. And he opens our eyes of our understanding so that, 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 the, that the light in the word of God becomes real to us. Amen. So that we may know the hope of why he called us. He's trying to show you through revelation knowledge why, first of all, why you was born. Because you was born with a calling. You ever understand that? Yes. I'm saying it again. Only reason why you breathing, every one of us, is because God called you into the earth. That's right. That's right. Let's, let's, let's get that straight. Ain't called mom and dad had sex. They had sex because he called you in. Then my ovaries produced the egg. Then the, 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 no, no, the man juice came in, the egg and the, then you showed up. It's because he called you. And so he wants you to understand why you sucking up air. See? Well, and he won't know why you ain't doing nothing. Suck it up my air and why I put you in the earth. What's your problem? I ain't got no problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you do. Amen. Amen. And see, if, if, if nobody tells us, then we don't know. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Okay? Now, he, we got to know why he called us and then get an understanding of the riches of the glory of the inheritance that is ours because we are believers. Yeah. Amen. Amen. See, we got to get our sights up. Yes. Okay? You got to ask your daddy, if you, want, if you want that coach store, act like it. Go online, find out what it costs, open up, up a coach store, find out what the ring is, find out where, and, 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 and write it all down, just like I did here. Write down what you want, lay it before God, and talk to Him about it. Amen. You ain't got it because you ain't asked for it. God ain't short of money. That's right. Come on now. The ones that got it, the ones that asked for it. Amen. When you was a child, did you have to ask a problem and ask mom for anything? Huh? My son ain't gonna probably asking me for nothing. Hey, dad, hey. What, what you think? Think about what? They need Jordans. How much are they? Oh, they ain't gonna hundred eighty. But <laughs> oh, I, I need new socks. How much they? Oh, them ain't they, them right there. They ain't gonna they ain't gonna afford it. But for some socks. <laughs> Uh, you see, he, he set me up though. This is 40, but this is 15. <laughs> <laughs> Did he want two prayers at 15? Don't you? Yeah. Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Yeah. Uh -huh. Where well, yeah. Don't you? Uh -huh. see? I know. I know. I ain't got a problem with that. But see, and I ain't see. And please hear me. Please hear me. I had to get a hold of myself because I'm asking God. For a brand new car. Forty thousand dollar car. Mm -hmm. Hey, 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 that hey. What you think? <laughs> <laughs> it ain't the Jaguar, but it's a <laughs> huh? And we didn't say, so why can't you ask for stuff? Your kids ask you, ask your dad. He tells come on, let's, let, let's go back over here. Ephesians 1. Okay. Verse 18, Ephesians 1, 18, he says, okay, now let's go to 17. That the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of what? Glory. The Father of what? Glory. He gave birth to glory. Mm. May give unto you the spirit of what? Wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of him, God and Jesus, okay? 
He shall let you know the over and glory, everything exists. That's a coach store over there. Is that what you want? Come on now. Come on now. Hear me. No, no, no. Listen. Pay attention. Stop hearing people and hear God. Amen. 18. The eyes of your understanding, what? Being enlightened, that you may what? Know. What is the hope of his calling? Why he gave you birth? What the job supposed to be doing? And what the riches of the glory of his inheritance? He wants you to know how much he got. Yes. He got. He has what? All. all. What all mean? All. all. How can a joker be born in America with nothing? And then end up with an NBA basketball team he paid $12 million for that they try to take from him and give him a billion dollars in return. But y'all understand, he started with what? Nothing. He's telling, he's, he's telling us he ain't no better than you. He put in the work. So do you. Amen. 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 He keeps showing me a chain of beauty shops and barber shops. Do you know what I've done? I got the pills and the paper and I start writing down what I heard. So don't get mad at me when y'all see these barber shops and beauty shops start popping up all over the country. I'm telling you right now. I've already, I've already done it before. I had five in one time. Get five more, it'll be no problem. Probably going to be getting 50 of them. What do you want? That's it right there. That's it right there. Look, 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 look. Look at 19. And what is the exceeding greatness of his power to who? Us. Us. Exceeding power to you. Say it to me. To, to me. me. Who what? According to what? The working of his mighty power. You got to know how his power works. The problem of it is, we don't know how to make it work. I'm telling you how it works, but we don't believe that. I don't see working like, yes it is. Yes, yes it do. You ain't watching close enough. Y'all seen it, but you don't believe it. I told you, I can't remember nothing. 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 Nowhere to live, no job, no church. Nothing. 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 Say it again. Nothing. Nothing. See? And I'm trying to show you how this thing works. I don't know what I got to do, but I'm going to keep on teaching. Does somebody gonna catch it? Somebody gonna get it? She's catching it. That right there. That little rest catching it. This one's catching it. That right there's catching it. Come on, man. That was catching. She stood up on the Oh, shoot. Yeah, she got a fight up here. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> man. Y'all understand what I'm talking about? This thing. See, and, and it's easier than you think. Quit making it hard. It takes time. But it really ain't that hard. Let's see what the, the okay. Everybody raise the phone up. Everybody, everybody got a phone. Raise this raise it up. This raise it up. Yo, yours is God. Is it your lot? This raise. Yes. This raise the phone up. Okay. Now, you know what that actually is? You got in your hand. That's a computer. Mm -hmm. And this ain't that just ain't a phone. How many y'all know that that's a computer? Oh, yeah. You can Google, I'm telling you, you can Google, this, 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 if all y'all this, this, if you're in this vein now, you can Google coach franchises. And see how much it costs to have a franchise. Don't let the number scare you. Don't let the number scare you. Let it, write the number down and start talking to God about God. Oh, oh, God. <laughs> but this one, this is Dad. Father, is that what she calls? People tell me all the time, okay, even in, even in the vision, the vision here. I got over here, 
or have 100 members in it, $10,000 a month. Okay? Dallas Sea Sanctuary, $100,000 a month from tax office. Why are you put numbers on there? Go to the store and not know the, and not know the, not know the number. You can't buy nothing unless you know the number. God wants specifics. That's why there's $40,000 on here. $40,000 on here. He needs to know. Your kid asks you so much for the first thing you want to ask him. How much is it? Mm -hmm. How much it costs? Yeah. Are you going to tell him, well, well, and then we do that. Honey, we go on a cruise. How much it costs? It, it ain't but. It ain't but. <laughs> <laughs> $4,000 a piece. Who all going? All of us. <laughs> 10000 where that coming from? Ask your father. <laughs> Amen? Y'all still here? Okay, now. We have to get the reality of the greatness of the power God has given us through Christ Jesus. We have to grasp the immensity of this glorious way of life he has for Christians. The extravagance of his work in us that trust him. Amen. Amen. We have endless energy and boundless strength. Amen. Amen. I'll say it again. We have endless energy. We have energy that don't run out. Stop acting like you ain't got no power, God, because you do. And we have boundless strength. Amen. All this energy emanates from Christ. And God raised him from death and set him on a throne deep in heaven in charge of running the universe. Everything from galaxies to governments. And not just for the time being, but forever. Amen? Amen. He's in charge of it all. He has final word on everything. Amen. Amen. And at the center of all of this is the church. That's the part that we don't get. That's the part that the enemy has done the best job in having you think that you ain't worth nothing. Because some guy raped you. Some guy molested you. Some woman cheated on you. Somebody whatever to you, robbed you, stole from you, whatever, now you feel you have no worth. Guess what? The church is full of all that. Amen. All of us. I, I was molested as, as a little boy. I'm still here. I wanted to kill that joker. Amen. Hallelujah. I didn't think I could, I could ever love another human being. I wanted to kill everybody I knew. He took that away from me. Amen. Amen. I'm telling you. And I seen that joker one day. I was one of this. But he old joker. He old joker now. I was gonna kill him. But it's all right. all right. God took care of him. Amen. 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 I ain't got to take care of you. See, I'm not ashamed to tell on myself. That's right. That's right. I'm trying to help you all. <laughs> everyone, everyone on y'all know that you can be whatever. I don't care what somebody done to you. I don't care what you're in right now. It don't matter what you got your hands on. It's right there. It don't matter. Be saved. Believe. Trust God. Don't deny he lived. Don't deny that he went to the cross and died and rose again. Don't ignore it. And I'm going to tell you this. Stop explaining it away. Why you ain't got what you're supposed to get because you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing. Amen. Ain't no limits on God. Ain't no limits. We say this all the time. No limits. My God is an awesome God. He, yeah. I can't tell. Mm -hmm. I can't tell. See, but we gotta we gotta get to the place to where we trust Him more than we do. Amen. 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 Because it's, it's available to us. Stop being the victim. Amen. You're the victor. Amen. Stop letting your circumstances conquer you when you are the conqueror. You're more than a conqueror. Greater is he that's in you than he that's in the world. Amen. But you gotta put God first. That's the thing we don't want to do. We don't want to put God first. We want to be first. No, you be second. 
No, I'm not going to say, you be third. Amen? Write, write, write this down. Write down joy. J-O-Y. J-O-Y. Leave your little, little room. I'm going to give you something to go up under. Write under J-O-Y. Joy. Jesus. Write Jesus. Then put others. Then put you. That's joy. Jesus. Others. Then you. You put Jesus first. Take care of others. All that take care of you. Amen. He said, he said, all things work together for the good of those who love the Lord. What? And I what? <laughs> call according to his purpose. We all call. Okay? So whatever you're going through, God will work it out. For your good. And see this thing. See, we, we want to, we want to, we want to take place when? Now. Now. No, no, no. You gotta, get, you gotta go through the process. Amen. That's, that's the reason why they, 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 we got KFC. Folk don't want to cook. <laughs> if you want to fry some chicken, it's a process. Huh? Amen. They go to the store, and before the store had it, was a real process. They go grab a joke and bring it in there. <laughs> they run around a little bit until he dropped dead. Then boil it and pluck all the feathers off of him and cut him and gut him and all that stuff. And, and, Whole, 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 whole lot of y'all be there at the terror. Hallelujah. Come on, man. Well, see, there's a process. I, I want to talk to y'all, taking my time talking to you because some of y'all don't, don't, don't understand. Some of this, some of this y'all just hearing for the first time. Some of y'all already know I got to refresh your memory. Okay? It's a process. <laughs> yes, you prayed. Man, then you gotta do is what? Wait. And while you're waiting, wait on the Lord. What's that mean? It's just this right here. And, you know, this, this is what it means. I'm showing you. How am I serving, Lord? Wait, wait on. What do you need, Lord? Now get you another Lord. Anything else before I leave, Lord? My wife. Anything else today, ma'am? I treat my wife like a queen. If y'all don't know that by now, that girl don't want for nothing. Amen. Nothing. Amen. When I was here, she took care of everything. Amen. I take care of everything now. All right. Amen. 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 That's what it's about. But I haven't the gun in my head for it. Treat her right, Lord, you show. Sure. <laughs> Amen. Amen. So, let's go back over this. Now, all this energy emanates from Christ, and God raised him from death and set him on a deep throne, a throne deep in heaven, in charge of running the universe. The one that saved you is in charge of the universe. Yes. Everything from galaxies to government. What do you need? What do you need? I hadn't heard from my daughter. In almost three weeks. She's in prison. She got locked up in prison. She's in prison and locked up and got thrown in jail. In, in jail. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, she ain't had called me for about three weeks. I said, what's wrong? I said, yeah, I said, I said father. Daddy. Hey. Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> He's here for my daughter. <laughs> Yesterday morning she called last night. Amen. And her brother did too. Amen. Amen. See, now I'm, I'm petitioning now. Lord, it's, they need to be released. They, need to, they both yes, need to be yes, paroled. Yes. You know what he told me? In due time. Amen. Good answer to me. <laughs> I believe him. And, and I trust him. Amen. So, he's in charge of it all. He has final word on it. Not the warden. Not you. Not the president. Come on now. Not, not the, your boss on your job. Jesus got the final word on everything. Petition Jesus. He'll change your boss's heart. Tell God about it. He'll soften your husband heart or your wife heart. 
or change your kids around. Amen. If you're acting a fool, tell God. Amen. But see, I'm, I'm going to say this to you. I'm going to say this to you. <coughs> that, that, that I'm going to close up. You get to praying for that husband, praying for, for their wife, praying for their kids, and God start roughing them up. See, you, you can't come in and save them, man. Yeah. 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 Why they, what, what he, why he choking them out? <laughs> you supposed to get, stay out of the way and let God choke you and choke out. <laughs> Is that you, Lord? Have at him. You okay? You need pray? No. When I was going through, my wife didn't, my wife didn't come save me. I was, I was, it was pitiful. 18 months for me to get myself together. 18 months. I'm telling you, that's just how bad I was off. She let, she let, she let the Lord have his way with me. He had it too, boy. I'm talking about he had it. And you got to, when you, you praying for your, hear me now, when you praying for your husband to change, praying for your wife to change, praying for your kids to change, they're going to go through some mess before they get it straight. I thought you told me he was going to be all right. Well, he, he's getting it, man. You got to go through that. Come on now. Same, same thing with you. If you're praying for God to change you, it ain't going to happen overnight. Uh, yes, Lord, Lord, I want Jesus. Okay, yeah. Now, the other thing, too, is when he's bringing you out of that mess, when he brings you up out of it, some of that same emotion that you felt going through, you're going to feel it. <coughs> you might, you might even see the, 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 the woman or the guy that unless you, or raped you, whatever he did, or they robbed you, they broke you down, they shot you, they stabbed you, they cheat, whatever, you're going to feel that some, some of them same emotions when he's bringing you back to it. Amen. The whole lot of time when we bring you through, you feel that and you quit. That's right. I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, amen. Mm -hmm. You feel that emotion, and he's bringing you through, yes. and you can smell her. You can see him. Mm -hmm. ah, no, no, no. Hold, hold on. Jesus. He got to pull you through. Hallelujah. And when he pull you through, you come out smelling like a water like a rose. But you can't quit. Because you got to understand. Please hear me. Please hear me. Please hear me. The devil is fighting you to stay in there. That's right. Come on. We got to pull you through the stink. You got to pull you through the pull you through the, the molestation, through, through the rape, through the getting robbed, through the abuse, through the abandonment. He pull you through. You're going to smell, feel, taste all of that. Your heart, you're going to be crying. You have nightmares, but you got to come through it. Stop. Give me that. Stop stopping mid deliverance. Come on. Jesus. Don't leave the baby breached. It's just like how you women that had babies. And the baby, and doc said, What? Well, we're almost there. We're almost there. Push one more time. I can't. Push one more time. Mm -hmm. Come on. Now all of a sudden, there that little joke come. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then they bring in a little green, slimy, blood, red. I mean, they brought my oldest daughter to me, and I said, wipe her off first. <laughs> <laughs> what you Right off. Yeah, you right off. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Y'all still here? Amen. Yes. Amen. Let's all stand. Let's all stand. So as you look at it, you have two choices. Believe it or don't believe it. That's right. Jesus died for those who believe. And that's the truth. Deny it, ignore it, or rationalize it away. Amen. Amen. Let's lift our hands. Father God, thank you, God, today for this awesome, powerful day today. Yes. We ask, Father God, that, that you would touch hearts and touch lives, Father God, today. Yes. And I ask that this word, Father God, will be sealed in our hearts. Say this, say, Father. Father. I thank you. I thank, thank you. For the word. For the word. That I've heard. That I've heard. Today. Today. The emotions. The emotions. The book. Brought up, brought up that I feel, that I, feel, feel, that I sense, that I sense of, the hurt, of the hurt and the pain, and the pain that, I went through. that I went through. 
Thank you, thank you, you for delivering me, for delivering me, and setting me free, and setting, setting me free as I walk, as I walk, walk in the newness, in the newness of life, of life in Christ Jesus. In Christ Christ Jesus. Jesus. I thank you, I thank, thank you, you as you order, as, as you order my steps, my steps, steps as you lead me, as you lead me and guide me, and guide me into the place, into the place the I was born, I was born to be in, to be in, walk in, walk in, and the person. In the person I am, I am to be. To be. Thank you, Lord God. Thank, thank, you. thank you, Lord God. In the name, in the in the name, name of Jesus. Of Jesus. Jesus. Amen. 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 Father God, we thank you, Lord God, today for the eyes of serious and heard. Be prepared to leave this place, but never from your presence. We ask, Father God, that the Holy Ghost come down and comfort us in our hurt, in our sorrow, in our pain. We thank you, Lord God, today. We ask that angels be with us yes, Lord. as we go. Yes. Protect us, guide yes, for us, and comfort us, Lord God, now. We honor and give you glory. For it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Amen.